Hey YouTube, this is Tech Reviews to you, and today I'm going to show you how to um, repartition your hard drive. Now, this will allow you to repartition it without losing all your data. Before you do this, guys, please make sure you back up all your data because WinClone can be unreliable. Um, it's not for certain that this will back up your data because sometimes you may get an error. So just to make sure please back up your data before you do this so you do not lose any of your data so what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to download WinClone for Mac I'll put the link in the description below and um, once you've downloaded it you need to go to applications load it up and click agree Okay, so once you've done that, you need to go continue and continue again and then install. You need to accept the uh, licensing agreement and type in your password. Installation successful. Now, what we're going to need to do is go back onto WinClone. Okay, so now when you're on this screen, you just got to choose the source where um, your partition is so in, it's most likely going to be in boot camp and um, click image now this is where you're going to choose where to save it so um, I'll save in documents and we'll call it win7 okay And now what I will be doing is cloning your Windows partition. This may take a while, so um, I'll stop the video here and um, carry on when it's finished. Alright guys, it's finished now, and um, what you're going to want to do is click OK. Now that's done, let's get rid of that for now. Now what you're going to want to do is go to um, partition, so applications, and then utilities, and disk utility. You're going to want to click on partition, and then you're going to need to erase the bootcamp partition. and remove okay now that's gone okay so once you've erased your partition we will go into boot camp assistant which is in applications utilities Bootcamp Assistant. Alright, now here you're going to want to click continue. Click the one below. Continue again. Alright, now here is where you want to choose how much um, memory you want to give to your partition. So beforehand I um, gave it 100 gig, but I've run out of space so I need to give it more. So I'm going to say about 300 gig. And then once you've chosen how much you want to partition, you click the partition button below. Okay guys, it's finished. Now, when we get here, we're not going to start installation. What we're going to do is quit and install later. Now, after you've done that, we're going to open up WinClone again. Agree. Now, restore. And now select image and find um, the file and once you found it the Windows 7 partition or whatever partition that you've cloned once you've done that mount it this may take a while so um, I'll pause the video here and come back when it's finished okay guys it's done so now what you're gonna wanna do is select the destination as bootcamp 
and then all you need to do is click restore now once you click restore it should um, restore it to your bootcamp partition and it should be fine okay so thanks for watching guys please rate comment ads and subscribe